What if the future of energy lies in a simple glass of water? Ever thought about the possibilities of water fuel engines? The idea might sound like science fiction, but it's a reality we're inching closer to every day. Water fuel engines, or more specifically, water fuel cells, are at the forefront of this cutting-edge technology. They operate based on an electrochemical process, where electrical energy is produced from the chemical reaction between hydrogen and oxygen in water. These engines have immense potential as an alternative source of energy. Not only are they highly efficient, but they also emit clean water vapor, making them an environmentally friendly energy option. However, the path to harnessing this power isn't without its challenges. Storing and distributing hydrogen, the fuel for these engines requires advanced infrastructure technology. Plus, the production of hydrogen itself often necessitates additional energy sources. So how exactly do these water fuel engines work? Let's dive into the fascinating process of water electrolysis. Water electrolysis sounds complex, doesn't it? But it's simpler than you might imagine. Picture this. You have a water molecule made up of two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. Now we're going to use electricity to break those bonds and separate the components. This process, my friends, is water electrolysis. So how does this magic happen? It starts with two electrodes immersed in water. When these electrodes are connected to an electrical source, they start to work their magic, breaking down water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen. But what do we do with this hydrogen? Well, it's not just a byproduct, it's a valuable source of fuel. We can store this hydrogen and use it later to power a variety of devices, from cars to power plants. Now that we've extracted hydrogen from water, what's next? Let's explore the magic of fuel cells. Fuel cells are like tiny power plants, generating electricity right where it's needed. These fantastic devices produce this power by combining hydrogen and oxygen from the air. Picture this, a fuel cell is essentially a sandwich with the bread being the electrodes and the filling is the electrolyte. Hydrogen, our fuel, passes over one electrode, the anode, and is split into electrons and protons. The protons move through the electrolyte to the other electrode, the cathode, while the electrons create a current that can be used. At the cathode, these electrons and protons combine with oxygen to produce water and heat, our only byproducts. This process is not only highly efficient but also remarkably clean, with water vapor being the only emission. Yet these water-fueled engines also pose challenges primarily in the storage and distribution of hydrogen. water fuel engines hold great promise for a sustainable future. But like all innovations, they come with their own set of challenges all of which we need to overcome to truly harness the power of water.